Donnie's out there that you, you think you can buy her back. I'm talking sending her flowers and gifts and trying to take her on getaway trips, bro. Turning up to her workplace to surprise her, bro. This is all wrong. This does not work. She has told you that she doesn't want you. Less is more. Do nothing. Absolutely nothing. Which means this is a Mexican standoff. Old school Clint Eastwood. Hey, I'm the quickest trigger in the West. Mate, she is going to play the long game. Don't worry, bro. I got I got some methods in this video that's going to help you out, bro. But I'm just saying, just off rip from disclaimer from the beginning. Don't think you pulling back, you going no contact 30 days is going to get her back, bro. Because at the end of the day, hashtag this bitch is stubborn. Tragic, tragic. Oh my gosh, how to get a stubborn ex back. I get it. Mate, big topic. I'm going to get straight into it, bro. Make sure you smash the like button on the way in, bro. Drop a comment, leave an emoji. It takes one second. It helps me out with this YouTube algorithm. It helps the channel grow. Don't be a ninja watcher. Support your boy. All right, bro, I get it. She's stubborn. Maybe she's strong and independent. Maybe she has masculine traits. Or maybe she's doing it on purpose. Women can be stubborn for so many reasons. Your ex can be stubborn for so many reasons. Maybe you stopped playing your role. Maybe you played your role too much. Maybe you smothered her. Maybe you didn't give her enough space. For so many variables, bro. Hashtag the variables. What I do know is that it needs to be your ex's decision to come back. And it needs to be your ex's decision to stop being stubborn. The also massive thing, bro, is, which is most important, you need to understand that it was your ex's decision to leave. She left you, bro. So, if she left you, you need to understand that she left you at your best, okay? Your relationship didn't work at its best. She was perfect, you was perfect. It didn't work. So, if you want to go take two, my question to you is why? However, no judgment. I'm just a complete stranger online. Unless you get coaching for me, then we're sort of boys at this point. The point I'm, no homo. The point I'm trying to make is if you're going back or you're trying to get her back, bro, the last thing you want to do is think no contact is going to work for a stubborn girl. She's stubborn, bro, which means she's headstrong, which means she has ego which means she has pride, which means this is a Mexican standoff, old school Clint Eastwood. Hey, I'm the quickest trigger in the West. Mate, she is going to play the long game. Don't worry, bro. I got, I got some methods in this video that's going to help you out, bro. But I'm just saying, just off rip from disclaimer from the beginning. Don't think you pulling back, you going no contact 30 days is going to get her back, bro. Because at the end of the day, hashtag this bitch is stubborn. Check, check, check. Can't force the situation, bro. She needs to want to come back for her. She needs to want to come back on her terms, okay? Less is more, bro. You cannot keep spamming her. You cannot keep telling her you miss her. You cannot keep begging for her. These are all feminine traits. These are all vaginal, bro. And these are all beta traits. Listen up. As I said before, you can't force attraction, bro. But what you can force is the reaction in her brain, okay? You need to go cold, incognito, bro. Go off the map. You have to make her miss you by taking yourself out of her life, bro. You have to make her miss you, bro. And that takes discipline and that takes ultimate commitment on your side. Okay? Before in the video, I said no contact isn't going to work, but it wasn't going to work if you keep spamming her, bro. No contact only works or has a high percentage of working when the girl sees your value you begging for it you spamming it with messages only lowers your value if you can be disciplined from the beginning as in as soon as she says look we're done you stop she's gonna spam you she's gonna miss you she has to think of life without you and those thoughts are what brings her back to you 
that stubbornness will go, bro. When you don't give her any attention, it's going to go. That ego is going to get destroyed. The pride, it goes, bro. You've been with her two, three years. All of a sudden, you're not there. There's no message from you. There's no calls, bro. There's no gifs, gifs, whatever you call them. No pictures, bro. Nothing. She's going to think about you. Donnie's out there. You, you think you can buy her back. I'm talking sending her flowers and gifts and trying to take her on getaway trips, bro. Turning up to her workplace to surprise her, bro. This is all wrong. This does not work. She has told you that she doesn't want you. Less is more. Do nothing. Absolutely nothing. Don't buy her nothing. Another gem I'm going to drop in this video, bro. Stop overthinking it. Stay out of your head. To get your ex back is not that difficult if you've done things to a good level in your relationship. I'm talking about... Did you demonstrate higher value? Did she see you as a higher value male? Did she have to seek your attention and validation in that relationship? Did she know that she was replaceable in that relationship? Did she know that you was the man and you made the decisions? And then she decided to, allow, to leave. Okay, no problem. If you play your role correctly, she will come back to you. So stop overthinking it. Stop trying to cram and, and trying to look for techniques to get her back or things to say or messages to send, bro. 30 days, no contact. Are you good enough to complete this first stage of the game? That's the question, bro. Remember, bro, I was talking about flowers, bro. Bro, I used to send poems, teddy bears, bro. Mate, I used to be a soy boy once upon a time. So when I'm telling you guys, I'm telling you, Real advice. Real. Don't do it to yourself. All you do is lower your value. You can't buy her back, bro. You can't buy attraction. You can't. It has to be chemical, bro. It's there physically, emotionally. You can't buy it, bro. Next thing on my list, bro. Give her space, bro. Give her space. Give her time. You can't force it, bro. Give her space, give her time. Even after you've done 30 days, no contact. You can go 43 days. You can go 50 days. You can go two months. Keep it going. She has to come to you. She has to break that no contact. Let her do it. She has to be submissive, bro. Let her come to you. Be disciplined, bro. I said it on the, one of my lives. I said, look, bro, if you need to delete her number, delete it. If you need to buy a new phone, buy a new phone. If you've given her that much value in your mind, you need to cut it out, bro. Cut it out. When you give her space, when you give her time to think and reflect and think of life without you, bro, she's going to suffer from FOMO. FOMO, the fear of missing out, bro. And that is what really makes women come back. Remember, she's tried to replace you. Or maybe she's stayed single and, and she's really been hurt by the situation. But it's... Remember, I said it, I say it again, I'll say it again, bro. It's the impressions that you give women that will make them attracted to you. Remember, your job as a man is not to impress her. Your job as a man is to give her impressions. Make her love the reality of your life so that she can't live without it. Remember, it's not what she does when she's with you. It's what she does when she's not with you. Think about it, bro. Can you make that impact when you trigger no contact? When you give her 30 days to 60 days of space, is she going to be thinking about you? Is she, going to, is she going to be going mad in her head? Think about it. Okay, as your stubborn ex is playing games or trying to play games with you, bro, what are you doing to improve? I get it. It's okay, she's your ex, bro. But what are you doing? Are you back in the gym? Are you taking cold showers? What are you doing to better yourself? Are you reading more books? You have to level up, bro. I always say it. Keep learning. Keep growing. Keep leveling up. What are you doing to better yourself? Remember, she's stubborn, right? She's stubborn for a reason. For so many reasons. Hashtag the variables. But if and when she comes back, bro, you need to be completely different. She shouldn't be able to recognize you. The way you talk to her should be different. She doesn't know when she's coming or going. 
when she's with you or when you get that second opportunity. Be very careful. I should have said disclaimer. Remember, I'm not I'm not promoting getting back with your ex, bro. But I'm just here to help you dunnies that are infatuated by your exes. Okay? I'm going to leave you with this. Respect isn't given. Respect is earned. But first and foremost, do you love the man you see in the mirror? Second, do you respect the man you see in the mirror? Those are the first two questions that you must answer in order to even think about getting back with an ex or accommodating an ex again. Because at some point in your life, the light bulb's gonna the light bulb's gonna go off. It comes down to I'm the prize, this is my show, this is my movie. And until you know that you're the main character, bro, you're never really gonna win. If you need coaching, man, reach out to me. I'm here, I'm ready. DM me, drop me an email, we can get to work. Keep learning, keep going, keep leveling up. Smash the like button, bro. Drop a comment, drop an emoji. It takes one second. Support me, bro. Peace.